ده إسراء المعراج comes in and as a theological matter makes it very clear long before the 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 direction of prayer was changed to Mecca but it makes it very clear the relationship between Islam and as we will see between Islam and the revelations, the monotheistic revelations before Islam. And it is the Isra and Mi'raj where the idea that the Kaaba is a, an Abrahamic product, obviously by Ibrahim and Ismail, as we know, alayhi but the, the idea that it, this is not about tribes, this is not about race, this is not about ethnicity, this is about the idea of monotheism, the concept of monotheism, and that what the Kaaba is anchored around is monotheism, and that the Kaaba is intertwined with al-Masjid al-Aqsa in Jerusalem, the symbol, these two are the symbol of monotheism. So when Muslims say Jerusalem is the third holy site, I actually don't like that. Jerusalem is not the third holy site. Jerusalem is an equal holy site because it is it is the other half for what represents the conviction of the monotheistic narrative according to Islam. That Ibrahim was a monotheist, Moses was a monotheist, and that Moses was not about a race. That Moses was about a religion. That Jesus was a monotheist. And that Jesus was not about suffering for people's sins. People, Jesus was about a religion. Islam. It's the same religion, time and time and time again. And that construct could only be so firmly established in the Isra and Maraj. Now, add to this once this became very clear, Muslims were on a clash, clashing course with the Israelites, with Jews, because the, the message of the Prophet, and as we will see as we study Surah Al-Baqarah, for instance, was that, you know, it, it, the, the idea of God, your God's chosen people, and you continue to be God's chosen people is not consistent with the monotheistic theology. This is not how it works anymore. God shows you for a purpose under certain circumstance and for a specific, because you were playing a specific historical role. But God's justice is the same and God's justice with you Israelites is the same with us Muslims. We either perform our role as God's people or God will replace us.